Hello everyone and welcome back to more Mystic Messenger! Yay! We are back! I know it's been so long, it's been so long since I ever last had an episode of Mystic Messenger since you guys have last seen a, a, mess, a Mystic Messenger episode. But we are back here now because yes, I have accumulated I think a good number of hourglasses now in order to do our, you know, our, some of our endings here and some of our after endings here because yes, in the last episode, we finished off Jehi's route. Yay! Completed the normal and the good ending. We saw like how it both en how it ended both ways. Um, there was a little bit of a drama, a little bit of something happening going on in terms of with B because he like came to Jumin. Game, are you okay? Are you doing okay? You don't you don't sound so hot. Are you what? Okay. Yes. Okay, good, we're good. Okay, so anyways, yeah, so... Uh, okay, ignore that. Please ignore. Um, J yeah. Jumin, yes, Jumin and V were talking because V showed up at Jumin's apartment and of course V spilled the beans about how he has liver cancer, I think it was. He was he was diagnosed with liver cancer and he's like, I'm gonna go where Rika is kind of thing. He's like planning to disappear and of course Jumin wasn't having any of it. But we didn't really hear much from that afterwards. Um, other than that, that Jumin kind of alluded to trying to like, you know, seek advice on how to like, you know, be a good friend to V in a very indirect way of his. And in turn of that, it just it led up to the point where he was asking us to be his assistant, kind of. And then of course Jehi swooped in and saved us and was like, nope, she's gonna be partnering with me to open up a little small bakery if that's if that's what you want. I kind of think if that's what you agree. So yeah, she offered you know a little key, and she's like, you know, I want to you know be in partnership with you, and you know that could mean you know that's like a, it's like a you know, one of two things in, in quote unquote partnership. It could be the business, or I could take it as you know actual partner partner. But anyways, yeah. So that's the good ending. But um, good ending, normal ending is basically just Jehi and Juman just fighting over us in terms of you know who has the better business proposition for us, and that's how it ended. Anyways, yeah. So that's it. And so now I've been gathering hearts and converting them to as many hourglasses as I can. But recently, if you guys still follow the game, of course. Sorry, my game is being really weird. It's like kind of bugging out and I hope I d it doesn't crash anytime soon. But anyways, as I was saying, basically I've been, oop, yeah. Basically I've been gathering hourglasses and converting them from hearts. But recently, if you guys still follow the game, of course, we had Yusung's birthday just recently. Oh my God, yes, happy belated to Yusung. And because of that, we were awarded, given like 50 hourglasses, I think. Something like that, something, a huge amount of hourglasses. And now we have, I have 53 hourglasses now. So I think we can, I hope, I hope it can, you know, get us somewhere in terms of more Jehi content so of course this episode I'm going to be doing um, you're gonna be seeing her after ending I'm gonna do that and of course I'm gonna jump uh, if it allows me to I'm going to of course jump into doing her first or uh, the first bad ending that we can get with her and I think it's like a bad relationship ending I'm not too sure I have to double check on that but anyways regardless it happens like way at the beginning of her route where we gotta do some work on in day five and then in order to get that bad ending but anyways regardless that's talks for later right now we're gonna be doing we're gonna get get right into our after ending and see you know what's good what's happening like did we actually open up a little bakery shop with her because that'd be really hella cute so yeah let's find out let's get right into it and it's been too long oh hey what it's a chat so damn meow damn shit this is shit jumin what's wrong <laughs> lol 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 what is there to lol 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 about are you having trouble still finding an assistant aren't you supposed oh. to stop me when i use an emoji <laughs> ah lamau lamau the boss should teach the employee oh is you sung employed under jumin now yeah jim has been making me work as his assistant for the past six months ah oh, there you go i thought he's the assistant now I'm just an intern, but everyone thinks I came here through connections because I work near his private office. You did get in through connections. You did get through in connection with connections, right? Uh, hoop, I like to be judged by my, for my abilities, thanks. But when he, when is he gonna? Whoa, you guys type fast. 
But when is he gonna hire a new assistant? There we go. I don't know. Please choose one fast. I want to do intern jobs. I'm going to make you my assistant. OMG. <laughs> OMG. Me. School starting soon. Uh, shut up. Bring me. Bring some wine. <laughs> Chumin. Seems like he's gonna uh, make you quit school. <laughs> Congrats, corporate slave. Jimin, which wine? You decide. Okay. <laughs> At least he's letting him decide. Okay, but can you tell? But you can tell me that through the the company line. This is more comfortable. La 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 la. <laughs> so everyone gets to hear about it. So why has this chat room become so entertaining after Yu Sung started working there? Think it's because he doesn't have an assistant. Um, but Mr. Han, what? What's making you say so damn much? What? I have to go there today. Today? What do you mean today? You haven't checked my schedule again. Oh, I'm busy with my own work. We have to go to Jehee's cafe today. Yay! We'll get to see Hanny again. Yay! Oh my god, that's today? I, I would have dressed better if I knew. Today's the opening day. Oh, that's so cute! They will. They were still under construction <laughs> last time I went, so I'm excited. I'm so excited, lol. I don't like that place. <laughs> Why? Of course you don't. They both don't want to be your assistant, lol. <laughs> I don't like that place. Don't be so petty. Oh, so that's why he complained about the construction team that am. Uh, oh, that so that's why he complained about the construction team being amateurs and all that. When Jay he told him that writing the coffee report helped a lot, Jimin's face was stern. So freaking bad. <laughs> Where's my wine? <laughs> On its way. Don't make the mistake of bringing red wine with a glass of with a glass for ice. Oh my God, I almost did. How did you forget what I told you only two days ago? I wonder how your brain works. It'll be fun if he becomes Jumin's assistant. It'll be so fun watching, la la la. <laughs> it would be, but poor, poor Yusung. He could just pick a capable assistant, always makes his life harder for himself. Please stop making personal judgments on my decisions, la la la. But has anyone heard from B? No. He, it's already been six months. Do you think something happened? I honestly don't even expect anything. Now, I don't, honestly don't even expect anything now. Jumin, I'm in front of your door. Open it. You open it. My arms are full. Then how are you sending the messages? That's Strong. a mystery. <laughs> it's text to speech. <laughs> or speech to text, yeah. Stupid. Alright, wait. Hey, aren't you supposed to be there soon? Jehi's Cafe, yeah. I'm gonna take my car to your place and then we'll go to Jumin's office. Alright, sounds good. We'll be there on time. Okay. Well, well what? Okay, uh, I don't like that. I don't like it that we're not hearing from B, but we'll have to wait. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was really fast. But anyways, yeah, I think Jumin's the only one who knows the where, like some sort of like hint, some clue. Oh, oh, hey, they're here. Wow, 예쁘다. It's pretty. Yeah. 이거 빵 굽는 냄새야? Yes, smell. Bread. 여자들은 왜 이런 걸 좋아하는지. <laughs> I was gonna say, like that's what that's what I understood what he said. Hey, my Korean is getting efficient, kind of. Isanim, wine name senayo. It's the wine. I smell wine. Yeah, you smell like wine. <laughs> 여긴 술도 안 팔겠군. Cause you, yeah, you drank before coming here. Is that why? Oh, they won't sell. Oh, they, they won't even sell drinks here. Yeah. Well, obviously. 내려요. Anyways, yeah, I was gonna say, I was like, this is a cafe, Jumin. Okay, we don't serve alcohol at a cafe. Yes, please. Let's go meet them. Let's go meet the ladies. Yes, let's go meet them. Okay. Hello, Jihee! And me, technically, because I'm there too. <laughs> oh, look at her! <gasps> She's so pretty! What? Jihee? Whoa! Jihee! And we told her last time before that we told her that you should grow your hair out now or something like that because she wanted to do something daring and like different and we're like, grow your hair out because you used to have long hair like before, you know, working with Jumin because Jumin always preferred her having shorter hair so then she's like, yeah, I'll grow my hair out it's gonna take a while but I'll grow it out She's so broke, she's so pretty! Oh my god! Also sale. Yes, hello, welcome! Welcome, welcome to the cafe. Do we have a name for that cafe? And why is it taking so long to like load the shit? Hello? Yes, hello. Sorry about that. What? Wait a minute, what? That's it? That's- wait, what? Wait, I'm so- That's so short! What? That's literally- that's literally it. That's literally it? That's I'm a little in denial right now, so like, hold on, give me one second, is it- Is it- Are you sure? What? 
Oh my god, that's seriously it! Oh my god, that's so short! What? Ah. I just went through it twice because I was in denial. I was like, is my game glitching out or something? Did I accidentally just fast forward that shit? No, it was that short. What the hell? Wow, okay. Hmm. Jay was robbed. <laughs> in my opinion, Jay's robbed. Jay was robbed of an after ending. Like, she looked, it's really nice and pretty to see her. How was like, she, like, she and her and like you know me me us us and her we opened up a little cafe shop like she said she would and that's cute like i i wanted to see more interactions in that like come on girl like what that's it okay fine anyways guys i guess that, that means we can definitely move on to oh thank you i guess it's one hour glass is okay in compensation for that short ass after ending that is not worth 20 hour glasses like god damn yeah, so as I was saying, we can definitely move on to doing, of course, Jaehee's first bad ending, which is all the way over here in the fifth day. So, I just need to quickly pull up a guide. Well, or quickly pull up, um, what's it called? Quickly pull up a, uh, a, this little guide that I'm using just to get an idea of what it is that I'm, spo I'm supposed to be doing. And it's not very detailed in terms of like answer wise, like a step by step answer, but I just need to know like what's my objective in terms of that. So give me one second. Okay, here we go. Simple enough. This It says it's the bad story end number one, which we're supposed to be, what we're supposed to do is to pursue Zen romantically and reject Jaehee's friendship all throughout today six. So we're gonna do all this all this day five stuff and we're gonna do the wrong answers we're gonna totally ignore jay he and supporting her and you know being a good friend okay we're gonna we're too interested in zen we're too obsessed with zen right now to really care about friendship good okay let's do that let's be a horrible person and uh yeah let's get let's get started cannot control myself i don't know if i should hmm what are you doing up? You're not drinking coffee anymore. Anyways, okay, so I think I'm gonna skip out mostly on you song stuff, unless you guys really wanna see it, just so I can do like opposite answers. I think I did what are you doing up last time. So let's just say you don't you're not drinking coffee anymore. Has he ever? Like I don't know. <laughs> don't even mention oh. coffee to me. I hate <laughs> seven. I started Lolo again. Of course you did. Okay. We're gonna skip on a little bit. Okay, what do I do? Don't you have finals coming up? Don't control yourself. Just follow all your urges and become the best. <laughs> yes, let's let's encourage this bad behavior. Yes, I will win back the throne. I'm applying for the Lala World Championship Tournament. Oh, Cream Roll, yes. We are not here to, uh, what's it called? Invite them to the party. So let's just, goodbye. Your journey's as sweet as Cream Rolls, as a Cream Roll. Thanks. My life so sweet, but useless, just like a cream roll. I don't even have a girlfriend, so why not just become a champion? I'll get going. Okay, cool. Eh. I mean, maybe I should have just not do these these um, conversations. Maybe I should just do the ones that have Jaehee and Zen involved, maybe. But then again, it's like I might miss out on a couple of conversations that might people might bring up Zen then or Jaehee and I'll be like, no, I'm not interested in Jaehee's friendship. I only want to become Zen's bae. That's what I'm here for. Anyways, let's continue on. I don't know. I can't. I cannot. Hopefully the remaining hourglasses here will last me to do this good and this, do this bad ending. So I see you're still up. Are you feeling lonely? Are you feeling wrongry? Wrongry? Yes, are you getting sentimental because it's late for me? Uh, well, yeah. I've never slept- I never sleep at night anyways. <laughs> but you sung that boy, I know, he's always up and playing Lolo. It's too- it's too, uh, it's a bad habit. Yes, I know, he doesn't care. So I was pretty serious about my future, yes. So I guess he'll get a girlfriend when he wins the championship. He's an adult, he can take care of himself. I guess he could get a girlfriend when he wins the championship. Blamow. <laughs> no way that's gonna happen, honey. The tournament is called Cream Roll. Why doesn't he know that? That there's no merit in winning a championship with a stupid name like that. <laughs> I mean, it is questionable. So, Zen, are you, are you too busy to get a girlfriend? Are you too busy working to get a girlfriend? Are there a lot of merits to your work? Are you too busy working to get a girlfriend? Maybe? Is that it? Tell me about your love life. Yeah, a girlfriend. <sighs> Sounds like something I won't get for a while. Why are you making me feel sad? Damn, Yusung isn't the only lonely one. Uh, lonely one, I am too. The stars tonight are very beautiful. <gasps> Aw, did we even get the this picture before? I don't think so. I'm practicing my lines this late night. Classic tragic case of workaholic losers. Zen, come to me if you get lonely. You'll get the chance someday to cheer up. Come to me if you're lonely. 
Come, tell thank you, even Fuck if yeah. I, it's just words. Can I really go? Haha, <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, I'm serious. I'm dead serious. I wasn't kidding. I just felt like making a late night joke. I wasn't kidding. I'm dead serious. OMG, what's up with you? <laughs> Be careful of men at night. I have to go practice now. Don't stay up too late, honey. <laughs> Goodbye, son. I miss you. Fogoshipta. Fogoshipayo. That's intense. Not that I don't like it. Alright, thank you. Okay. <laughs> He's so cute. Ah, I'm so whipped for Zen. Still, still now, up until now, I am still whipped for him. Anyways, there we go. So let's finally, Jaehee is in the picture. This is her little, this is her and Jumin's little dispute about how she did not schedule his little cherry trip, cherry farm trip, and he got super salty and mad about it. So let's just ignore Jaehee. <laughs> I know it sounds bad, but like, we need to ignore her. Good morning, Jumin. Thank you for the greeting. Ah, no problem. No problem. So, but my morning Shoot. hasn't been that good actually. Oh, I have to go to the cherry farm. But yes, Assistant Kang didn't book it, and she's like, "What do you mean?" And she's just like, "My cherry farm trip, woman." <laughs> yes, yes, yes. And he's just like, "It's important. It's for Elizabeth the Third. I'm supposed to, you know, get cherries for her or something." Yes. Okay. So yes, Jumin is uh, is uh, expressing his disappointment. And now, it's like, there must be a reason why Jaehee didn't do a calm down first. No, we're gonna say Elizabeth likes cherries? Oh my gosh, she does. Yes, she does. I didn't realize that cats eat cherries. They, they, uh, she doesn't eat them. She just likes the smell of them. Get it right. Why would cats eat cher- Why would cats eat cherries? It's poisonous. It's bad for them, I think. I don't know. I think just the pits. When she smells cherries, she rolls around with her fluffy stomach up. I do not know if you're aware of how rare it is to see that. I see. This is frustrating. <laughs> how can no one understand the beauty of cats? Last August, I was too quick. Yeah, it's occupied with the largest meerkat contest. Yes, Jumin is visibly upset. Alright. I have nothing to say to you. Yes, you forgot Elizabeth the Third's cherry farm. How disappointing. Yes. Who won the contest? Meerkat contest. Who won the contest? Let's be interested in that. It was the meerkat Dingo from Australia. Nice, good to know. Do you not remember that on August 27th I told you to book my flight? Yes. And she was just like, no, I need, I was too busy, I was swamped at work. Like, chill, relax. Okay, there we go. So Jaehee was just like trying to compromise. She was like, oh, I had another department schedule it for you and book it for you because I was too busy. Let me just go contact them right now. Of course, Jumin's being a little pissy pants. He's like, don't, you're the one who has to do it now. I don't care. So yeah, so Jimin, I think you're too irritable right, irritable right now. Being the super boss, su being the super mean boss. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's so sexy. Oh my god, yeah, I, I can repay with a super paycheck. I'll deal with it as soon as possible. Oh no, write a report on which department was supposed to book the flight. Yes, and uh, yes, it is. It is near my departing date, and I have not heard of anything from them. If I, I was wondering if they were doing the jobs correctly. Oh yes, of course. And I'll leave Elizabeth the third to you until I return, yes. So, I guess Jaehee gets paid for looking after the cat. How cool, haha. Do you really need to leave the cat with Jaehee? We need to, of course, disregard her feelings. <laughs> no need to thank me. <laughs> oh no, poor Jaehee, I'm so sorry. It is not as if you are staying there overnight. Is there a reason to leave the cat with me? What if something happens to Elizabeth the third while I get cherries? But you have the ver but you have a very tight security around your house, exactly. And he's like, no, I need someone to keep her company. Okay, there she, there he goes. So he says, Jaehee, you must earn a lot of money, including the pay for overtime. Haha, <laughs> Jumin, I think you're going out of line. Nope, we gotta disregard her. I do not want to talk about that right now. A cat, yeah. No matter how much I get paid, I think this is a separate issue, but I have no choice. I should clean up the house since the cat is coming, yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry I'm being so mean to you and discrediting you and, you know, not validating your feelings. Okay, bye, yeah, sure, goodbye. Bye. Yes, bye. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I feel so bad. I'm so sorry. Every single time I gotta do these bad endings. Just, ugh. I gotta be the jerk. Okay, Jumin is the boss. This is our next conversation with Zen. I'm not sure if I should necessarily answer emails or text messages just because I feel like it doesn't go too towards the cause. So let's just skip on doing that and go right into the conversation. So we gotta flirt on, we gotta get our flirt on with Zen more. So Zen, did you have breakfast? I feel so bad for Jay. No! Did you have breakfast? Papa Mogul Soil? Yes? Hey honey, yes. 
did you eat? Yeah, I did. I have to eat well since I do a lot of physical work. I don't like Jumin that. I don't like how Jumin that jerk treats her. Yes, that's how. That's too much even considering that he's the employer. Right. He worked. He worked with her for years, but he still treats her like a cat sitter. I would minutes, never yeah. work with a jerk like that. God, of course you n you wouldn't. Okay. So I think he makes her do everything since she's so good. I think it'd be nice to have someone like you as an employer. Zen, Zen, hey. wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Hey, me? Yes. I think it'd be nice to have someone like you as an employer. I don't really know if I have. I'm capable enough to have employees, but that's a compliment, right? Thanks. I would never act like Jimin. Of course not. If I remember right, yes, the whole meerkat business. Oh yeah, and of course Jaehee worked so hard that she nearly fainted, but then she just. Took an IV and then just went straight back to work. Oh my gosh, yes. So why does Jumin plan those kind of events to, and give Jaehee a hard time? Then do you happen to have feelings with Jaehee? Do you happen to have feelings with Jaehee? Huh? What do you mean? No way, Lola. I don't even know Jaehee that well. Anyways, yeah. I just wanted to say what what Ju to say Couldn't. that Jumin's wrong. Yes, of course. The meerkat contest is a waste of resources. Okay, so no matter how much work, how much uh, Jaehee values her work, I does it does. I doubt she's happy working overtime like that. So, she should be thankful that she has work at times like these. Aren't you the type to work all day too? I hope Jaehee gets through this crisis. No, we gotta discredit her, of course. Yeah, <laughs> you're right. At times like these, but I do my work because I want to. Yeah, and you love your work, right? Uh, I think the stress level is completely different when it's work someone and when it's work someone's ordered you to do. Oh my God! Look at the time. Yes. Goodbye. Yep. Yeah, bye. I love you, Zen. I love you. Yeah. <laughs> That's a joke, right? I'll get going. Oh my God! He's so caught off guard. Oh my God! We're so we're so we're do, we're so like coming on strong, you know? <laughs> Jesus. Okay, so I think I'm gonna skip ahead on this uh, story mode. Because I'm pretty sure nothing much happened, it's just the cat getting dropped off. Okay, there we go, yes, yeah, so she, the cat got dropped off, and now we, the, the a vicious ent enterpriser. Enterpriser? Yes, okay. So let's get on this, let's get, ch get to chatting. Get to, get to chatting. Okay. Let's see what Seven has to say along with uh, Yusun. So what? Hi, Seven. Yusun, you're not going to school today. Just say hi, Seven. I think. What did we? Did we Hello. greet him last time? I have no idea. Yeah. Hi, honey. Hello. I remember the meerkat contest. Yes. Let's talk more about the meerkat contest. It was super fun. Yes. The contest. His contest seems sounds a bit strange, but it does seem funny. Jaehee must have such a hard must have had such a hard time. No. His contest sounds a bit strange, but it does sound, does seem funny. No one can stop Jumin's love for cats. Yeah, <laughs> almost as intense as my love for cats. Uh, you don't love cats, you like to harass them. Yes, that's my way of loving. That's, yeah, the true. Okay, so Seven is just like, yes, I love cats and stuff. Seven, you can run, you should run for a cat cafe. You're pretty cruel too, Hanny. <laughs> she just understands uh, my love, la la. Anyways, I, I feel bad uh, for Jaehee, yes. All these office workers are like that. I'm also employed, yes. Okay, I was just reading the conversation, and I don't know if it's because it's been a while since I've last kind of like went back on this, but I feel like I feel like this this is like a lot of. Am I just tripping out? Is this like new conversation? Like they're talking about just work and internship and how life is cruel and shit and uh, capitalism. <laughs> I don't know. Anyways, like like they're just like. Yusung's just saying how like he doesn't ha he's not studying or something like that or no Seven pointed out that Yusung's not even studying and Yusung is like no yeah Seven is pointing out Yusung's not studying hard enough anyway so like why should you be depressed and of course Yusung is like I'm just getting more depressed just thinking about work and shit like that and getting a job and oh uh, yes and he's just like I should try harder in life like, you're trying hard enough in the world la la so and so I fall into the abyss of endless depression the har the internship it would be hard right looking at Jaehee I don't think I'll be able to handle working at his company. That, uh, that's kind of like familiar to me, like I kind of sort of remember something along the lines that he said that. He said, you thought of making money would be easy to, to, you know, in life every single dime matters. Every single dime you earn matters. Alright, I'm feeling the importance of money now, yes, but... And it's like, why isn't anybody liking my pictures? And it's like, well, I, I liked it. Okay, and then we should say, let's see. Uh, I don't think Seven deserves to talk about the importance of money. Your baby is your baby car is so awesome, wow. I don't think you deserve to talk about the importance of money. Look at all that money you have to buy import cars. Yeah, if he has enough money to spend on a super expensive car, he can't be he can't be a normal person. Seven oh seven equals normal. Um no, your brain isn't normal in the first place. 
The world is unfair. I should go back to my work as now. At yes, yeah, yeah. I remember this. Okay, maybe I'm just tripping. Yeah, I'm gonna go work and make a living too. Yes. <laughs> God, how sad. Honey, cheer up. Yeah, cheer up. Thanks, guys. Oh, I just finished a, a workshop today, so I'm good. I've done a day of my a day's work already, so it's all good. Anyways, let's continue on. I know, but I'm not gonna. Yeah, freelancing is the best. Okay, so this, yes. And I'm not gonna answer uh, Jay He's text messages again. We just gotta have to plow on through. And uh, yeah. Ah, uh, him, yes. Talk to me about being a freelance. The chat room's a bit strange today. Why? So, Zen, how's work? Living is it easy. How's work, Zen? We gotta ask him. We gotta ask after him. Oh, it was good. Thanks for asking. Yeah. It's sad to see that Seven and Yusung. It's sad to see what you Seven and Yusung said. It's not easy to earn money. But the reason why I'm jealous of Jay is because she earns a stable living. Yes. And yep. being a freelancer is hard. Yes. Uh, I'm amazed that Jaehee still works with Jumin. I still, I think you'd rather starve than work under Jumin. I'm amazed that Jaehee still works with Jumin. No, that's more leaning towards supporting Jaehee. We don't want that. I still think you'd rather starve than work under Jumin. Yeah, Lamao, yeah. I'd rather live as a freelancer and starve than work under a boss like Jumin. I do not think he pays well, but I'm scared that he would just get rid of her. If he counts... I do think he pays well, sorry. But I'm scared he'll just get rid of her. If he counts the numbers and thinks that she's not worth it, yeah. That's why I respect Jaehee, yes. Because she puts up with Jumin's bullshit. I respect Jaehee too. To be honest, I can't I can do as well as Jaehee. I can do as well as Jaehee. Yeah, sure, why not? Yeah, really? Then you're amazing too. I didn't know. That's cool. Look, I wanna talk more, but I have to leave night now. Oh, okay. Alrighty, stay with me longer. Stay with me. Oh, I feel bad if you say that. I would really I would really love to talk to you more. But I think the director wants to see me. Uh, he won't leave until I go see them. Go see them. Sorry, let's talk later, okay? Oh my god! Look at him! Okay, yeah, okay. <laughs> Don't be so cute. Anyways, I'm in a hurry, so I should get going. <laughs> I should... I need to feel bad that I'm doing Jaehee dirty right now because... But Zen, man! Zen! Zen! Zendo! How can I when there's a whole Zen here? And he's just the sweetest guy. Look at him just sweet talking to me. Anyways, oh god. Down to my last five, unless I can convert some more. I was hoping I could plow through it and make it through to the fifth day. Like, I'm so close. Oh, maybe I'll do a purchase this one time. And then I'll make it through this day. Oh, yes, I'm here. Yes. Zen probably doesn't have feelings for you. Just saying. Just so you know. Why are you suddenly saying that? I don't know. I do quite understand. God. Uh, Elizabeth keeps crying. She's like, I don't care about Zen right now. I just need to get this cat like out of my house. Yes, it's di it's still difficult, but Zen's words are quite comforting. You two seem to belong in a completely different to in completely different worlds. I don't know how he could comfort you. Zen says he respects you, Jaehee. Cheer up. Oh my god, this is so harsh, but I have to say it. Oh my god. What a bitch. I'm such a bitch. Yes, I know better than anyone that Zen is very different from me. I had to endure the pressure and anxiety from the company, but I think I think it is people like Zen that gives you strength. I know, girl. I'm sorry. Yeah, who must face the actual world and fight for the true life? Yeah. The reason why I like Zen's musical is because he's so passionate in what he does, right? Yes, you feel alive. You you actually feel alive when you watch these musicals. <laughs> Whereas day by day, you just feel dead inside. <laughs> Alright, so even in the suffocating moment where he could be the one who got to get murdered, yeah, she's just going on about how great Zen's plays are. So I knew Zen would be the perfect husband for me. Zen must be pretty amazing. He is the perfect hubby material for me, girl. She's like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> what? I think that is a wild fantasy. Anyways, from that musical, I was very inspired. Yes, I know. Oh my god, look at her. She's just trying to, just trying to rein in this conversation in. There I go, trying to just derail it. <laughs> I generally respect that part of it. Yes, of course. Yeah. Jaehee, you're too strong to endure all that stress and anxiety. There's a reason why Zen's so popular. Yeah, there's a reason why Zen's so popular. Of course. Duh. Of course. So I think he gives a lot of courage to not only me, but all the women who work hard. Yeah, so I'd be nice to, it'd be nice for Zen to date a fan, especially me too. Especially me too? Is it supposed to be selfish for me, or it'd be nice for Zen to date a fan? Um... Am I supposed to, Okay, this one's a little confusing, because... Me, it could be in reference to like me as a fan, but also it could be me as in like, oh yeah, I agree. 
with you, especially to me too, kind of thing. Or it's like, especially to me too, because he's mine, kind of way. What is this? I can't. This is why, this is why texting is a little bit on the iffy side, because you don't know what the tone of context is, you know? The tone. What's the tone here? Uh, it'd be nice for Zen to date a fan. Why not? Why not say that? I do not think he is very interested in dating. Oh, the cat is crying again. Okay. Maybe I should have said especially me. Oh my god. Okay, whatever. Uh, Jehee, cheer up. Zen and I are cheering for you. No, okay, goodbye. Just say okay, goodbye. Don't get too attached. Don't get too, uh, too affectionate. Okay. Okay, there we go. So let's, there goes my last five hourglasses. And I have one, two, three, four. Four conversations left. So it's like five, ten, fifteen, twenty hourglasses that I need to... Okay, let's see. Let's try. Let's... I don't think I'm gonna get twenty. I think I'm gonna have to buy a little bit more than that. But anyway, let's see what I can get out of the heart so far. Twelve seconds later. Okay, so I only made it up to eight hourglasses. It's so pathetic. I know, but anyways, regardless, I kind of figured I would need to buy more anyway. So I purchased thirty more. So there we go. So let's continue on with these conversations. You sounds concerned. I mean, should we really bother? Ah, uh, too late now. <laughs> too late now. <laughs> anyways. Uh, let's just, yeah, let's just continue here. Lolo, hey, are you saying Lolo? Are you doing the Lolo? Huh? No, I'm about to sign in, Lolo. Whoa. Okay, I think I said that before anyways. Oh, shit. So, yes. Yeah, so she says she respects Zen so directly until says, she, uh, but I've never seen her say she respects Zen so directly until now. So it's nice to see them show respect for each other. Was school okay? Let's just deflect. Was school okay? Oh yes, nothing much happened. Uh, school's well, just school. Lol, school's just school. Okay, so yes, there we go. This is what I was talking about. How like I know for a fact that even if I think I should skip out on like conversations that may be unrelating to our cause it's just that we might miss out on like this stuff where it's like you know other characters bring up uh, their characters and then we can obviously have our input and comment in it too so yeah that would obviously affect our bad ending or not okay so he told me not to hesitate in pursuing happiness okay so i don't really think jay he's happy zen seems happy doing his work just my type of guy yes see this is what i was talking about yes so there we go lolo zen's awesome yes he is so if he had his looks if i had his looks i'd have jumped up becoming famous he's good looking and he works hard so i'm sure he'll succeed i think of i think i am pursuing happiness but looking at the life that i'm living right now i suddenly feel so empty i know oh my god <laughs> Same. <laughs> anyway, so not because you don't have a girlfriend, because you don't know what makes you happy. Not uh, because you don't know what makes you happy. Not because you don't have a girlfriend. Okay, let's just say that. I feel like I said something. I said the other thing before. So we're we're here to get some different answers here. Uh, but if the problems was going to be solved by getting a girlfriend, I think I'd end up relying on her too much. I, if we break up, I'd feel like I've lost everything and drink with my friends singing breakup songs and up, end up blaming everything on my ex-girlfriends. I sound pretty pathetic, Lolo. Yeah, you do. <laughs> don't know if it's being defensive or being wise. I don't know what you mean, but it sounds like you don't want a girlfriend. Don't know if it's being defensive or being wise. Lol, this is a new answer, right? Like, we never had him say or comment on that before. Lol, lol, thanks for thinking that way. I know I'm a coward. Anyways, I know Lol will get rid of my emptiness. Talk to you later, yes. Alright, don't be too much of a game addict. Okay. Lol, today, tomorrow, and forever and beyond. Lol gives me a purpose in life. I'm gonna go exterminate trolls now. Okay, bye now. <laughs> have fun. Anyways, yes, let's go. So there's that. Okay, so not much. But anyways, Jaehee is in on this conversation with Seven. So hopefully we can, of course, do a little bit more damage. So I agree with you, Sung. People should pursue happiness. Yes, hey, Seven. Jaehee, do you still have a lot of work? No, we need to greet Seven. We don't, we're not here to greet Jaehee. Uh, hey, hey, hello, Hanny. Yes, hello, hello. Uh, currently, I am not... I, currently, I am not happy because of the cat. And she's he's like, yes, give me the cat. He's like, no, you don't. Just give it to him. If anything happens to the cat, Jay, he will be responsible, so I oppose. No, just give it to him. She's like, no, obviously not. Yeah, give me, law. Take good care of it. The day I give the cat to Seven will be the last day I go to work. <laughs> True. You become free, though. And then you can get, you know, free from the company, free from the cat. And it's like totally free. Two birds, one stone. Freedom is expensive, but chained to money. But chain to money. Money, money, money. Yeah. <laughs> money, money. It would be nice if it's easy. It would be nice if it's easy as Seven says, but I live in a capitalistic world. Right. Money makes everybody a slave. You are making me depressed. This game isn't a visual novel, but it gives you more than two options. 
Uh, we should say that. I didn't. I didn't say that last time. Oh? I do not know what you two are talking about. Anyways, you said something similar before. Please don't remind us of really uh, uh, again how sad how sad reality is. Yeah. Okay, blah, 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 blah. Seb is just talking about how it's like, you have the right to be happy too, you know? Even if, you know, what you do to make you happy is what questionable? No, I know. <laughs> He's just like, you know, you're why are you the one who's giving me life advice when, you know, it's like, you're not the type of person that should be talking about giving advice. But Seb is just like, but no, you you become happy and you're happy when you watch his mu like Zen's musical, right? So it's just like, it's the same thing. You have the right to be happy. And so our answers here can be like, I feel like I'm about to have a heart attack every time I see his musicals. I want to have him as my husband. I want to hardly him. I want to be. I want to have him as my husband. Yes. What? Yes. Do you have feelings for this then? A love triangle. What do you mean a love triangle? This is totally not it. Lol, if you don't take him fast, Hanny, the new girl, will snatch him away. Zen is not prey, and I do not consider Zen that way. Lol, lol, fine. Anyways, what Seven said is right. It is true that I feel happy when I watch his musicals, and I think everyone knows oh, that. Yeah. Too. Don't give up on love. <laughs> Please do not suddenly change subjects when talking. What do you really want to say? Okay. Uh, my guess is that he wants to say Zen sexy. I think he means that he wants you to find someone you love and become happy. No, Zen sexy. That's not wrong, but <laughs> I think that's what that's what Hanny wants to say. It seems that it seems that Seven has confused your brain, Hanny. Your brain, Hanny. Oh my God! Did you didn't you realize my words? I congratulate. Blah, 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 blah. Find, finally, follow the conversation now. Blah blah blah. Yes. Jimin's gay, Mr. Han's not gay. I have never seen him in a girlfriend, but he's definitely not gay. Yes, there we go. <laughs> uh, then he is a statue, a man he, a man you can never get. So cool. A man you can never get. <laughs> so that is your taste in men. <laughs> all taste, all a matter of taste. Anyways, like this, you'll end up finding someone of a marriage, uh, finding someone through marriage and marriage meetings and marrying without love. Yes, yeah, so Jehe, I mean, Seven is trying to like help Jaehee in terms of finding oh. happiness and he's just like find a significant other and she's like nah she's like I can't uh, I think Jaehee thought enough about whether or not she's on the right path just go to the marriage meetings and get it over with yeah why not oh my god lol how could you be so harsh <laughs> did I ever do something wrong to you Hanny? <laughs> I think her fingers slipped cheer up cheer up for what I managed to do something good today too I'm gonna go for a drive I'm gonna go to, on the date with my car you don't do you do have insurance, I assume? My love for my car is the best insurance. <laughs> I know. I was saying, like, God, girl, what are you being such a bitch for? <laughs> but I have to. I have to. Drive safe, Seven. I don't know what advice you gave, but goodbye. Yeah, bye. Yep, yeah. Drive safe. Okay. Why do I feel uncomfortable right now? Well, why do you feel that way? Maybe because Seven talked about dating. Maybe because Seven talked about dating. Yes, I think so too. Oh no, I'm agreeing with her. Damn it, I'm not very interested in dating. I gave it, I gave up at it at one point. Yes, she's just like, no, I don't have time for dating anymore. Yes, but she wants a friend to talk to. She's like, it's so hard to meet people like that. I think I could be a friend. I could be that friend for you. No, it's so hard to meet people like that. Yes, that's that is quite depressing. I should get going now. I had fun talking to you. Let's deflect her. Uh, hope you get a lot of work done. Yeah. Yes. I'm a bit depressed. Then bye. <laughs> <laughs> look at her. Look at us. We just totally completely shut her down. I'm so, I'm so, oh my god. I honestly need to like check myself. <laughs> but anyways, all for the sake of science. Jaehee and love. Okay, let's get talking with Zen and Yusung and get more of our input flirt, flirt points with, uh, with Zen here. Yes, so another round of Lala has ended. Yes. Anyway, Zen. Zen, you're still up. Oh my god, Zen, talk to me. Talk to me, my future husband. <laughs> uh, honey, you're still up. Yes, I am. I want to see you, Zen. I want to see you. Um, <laughs> how am I supposed to take that? Oh, uh, gosh, I'm sweating so much after playing the last round. Wow, you really, you totally saved the world. Yes. I love how it's like, Zen's just so uncomfortable, but like, the, honestly, Hanny right now is just being so headstrong. She's just like, Zen, you fine piece of ass. Like, I want you to be my husband. <laughs> Zen, don't you want to date? Yeah, don't you want to date Zen? He's like, I want, huh? What do you mean, lol? I, of course I want to, lol. Then date me. What about me? <laughs> do you want to date me? Yes. Yes. 
Yes, Rafa, 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 la la la. Honey, you're so, you're lonely too. Wait, lol. We've all given up on dating, but I hope at least Jay he finds someone. Yeah, seven seven two. Why is everyone wor something worrying about Jay he? Uh, well, that's because we're guys, but women usually marry earlier than men. Yeah, that's being sexist, and you're you talk as if you're so old. Maybe Jay he doesn't want her significant other, you know. So it doesn't have to be through dating, but I want Jay. No, I don't have the luxury to worry about Jay he. Zen. Date me! Just take me! <laughs> Just take me! <laughs> oh my god, Hanny, do you like Zen? Oh my god, are you my fan? Yeah, I'm more than your fan. I'm in love! I'm in love! <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> no, haha, you're just joking. So. <laughs> I love how he's good. he's like deflecting it. He's just like, uh, okay, girl. <laughs> this is so funny. Oh my god. So Jay, he needs to find someone faster than all of us. Okay, so yeah, before she gets older, no. I think you two are all just prejudiced in her age. That will restrict her for that will restrict her changes for love. What? That her age will restrict her changes for love. Yeah. No. Yeah. Before she gets older, she should start dating. We need to do that. Yeah. So she's in her late twenties now. Uh, yeah, a lot of people must be pressuring her by now. Shouldn't we try not to pressure her though? Yeah, nah. Uh, who would say all these things except us? That's true. But I have a question. I think Jay, he's overrating my musicals and performances. Yeah, he's just like, I'm a little like, I don't know. Of course, just my just looking at my face is a great experience. Of course, of course. Anyways, yeah, so... Yeah, so Jay, he's my fan, yes. So, nah, lol. <laughs> Do you even have to ask, nah? <laughs> Nah. Oh, hey, what are you talking about, Hanny? I know, wait, no. She's a huge fan, really? Yeah. She, Jay, he's such an intelligent person. I know, right? She's a huge fan of you. I know, oh my god. She really likes you. Yeah, I'm so shocked you didn't know. Uh, she, she always says how good things about your performances. Yes, Jay, he even respects you. Probably just a slightly interested girl, number one. Oh my god, I'm so rude. I'm so rude. I knew she was interested by my fan. No. Hanny, I thought you were close to Jay, he. <laughs> She's a huge fan. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm not that girl right now. <laughs> you missed that girl opportunity already. So yeah, we're not here for that. What do you think about Jaehee Zen? Is she attractive? What do you? Why are you asking Zen that? I think she's extremely. Why are you asking him that? He should be the one who thinks I'm attractive. Yeah. <laughs> so what? Jaehee might feel embarrassed. Zen, am I attractive? Do I? Am I pretty? <laughs> am I pity? Oh my god. Um, <laughs> I can't say because I haven't seen you yet, but I think you, I think if you was a good person, uh, we were just talking, we were talking about Jaehee. To me, I think Jaehee can go on a date with whoever she wants, yeah. Cool, cool. Yes, asking Zen is a bit, Zen, don't you think she's an amazing woman? Asking Zen is a bit, yeah, is a bit, what? Oh, I get to, I get to type both. I have dibs on Zen, because I love Zen. Because I love Zen. I have this on Zen. Lol. Hmm, which one? Which one? Because I love Zen. Uh, I have dibs on Zen. I I love Zen. No, I don't know. They're they're both they're both the same thing, aren't they? Like, I need to. Ex I have dibs on Zen. Lol. Because I have I love Zen. Yes, I love Zen. Don't know what to say. <laughs> I think she's just trolling us, right? <laughs> oh my god. To answer you Song's question, I don't really care for looks, so I don't know, but I think she's beautiful, yeah. She's a good career, she has a good career, stable job, and she seems better than, than me at everything. Maybe I shouldn't- I don't know, I think like the whole dibs on Zen thing is a little too joking, that's why. She, and I said lol at the end too, so it's like not serious, you know? So I, I was gonna- I was going for a more serious approach. Okay, so what about inviting- you know, then we should never invite them. Let's not invite them. Sad, but that's probably best. <laughs> what do you think about having someone like Jaehee as your girlfriend? How about it? That totally threw me off there. I never really thought about that. Well, what if? Just what if? What if? Hello? What do you think? What do you think about me? Why are you putting him in a corner, lol? You don't even have one. <laughs> oh my god. You don't need to. You don't need to drag him, does well too. You don't need to roast him while you're defending Zen. Okay. What do you think about me? Right? You, honey? Yeah, me. You seem cute and strong on the outside, but delicate on the inside. That kind of woman? <laughs> What about Jaehee? Hmm, Jaehee has a stable life, so wouldn't someone like her be a better suit? Oh. Yeah, my environment is really like unsteady and stuff like that. It's just, yeah, yeah. How should I say it? 
Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Oh, my friend is telling me to sign on Lolol. Yes, I do think she's amazing, yeah. But how do we end up talking about this? I should go and rehearse, yes. I'm gonna go practice until I feel tired and just fall asleep. Okay, don't work too hard. Okay, bye. Don't work too hard. Thanks. Okay, I'll get going. I love how so thrown off Zen is throughout the entire thing. He's just like, uh, what? Lol, okay. <laughs> Poor guy. Poor guy. Oh my god, I'm so sorry for putting you through this. Okay, last conversation. I totally did not forgot to like look up when it is that the bad ending is supposed to be, but it says to do all the bad answers, all the, the interest show interest to Jumin throughout day till day six. So like I don't know, maybe at the beginning of day six? I don't know. I will see. I'm sure I'm doing a good enough job to be able to like you know you know, when I see it I'll know. Okay, so Jumin, how was your business trip? Yeah. How was your business trip? Okay, we're gonna skip on to these little small talk here. And it's not really not really in relation to, to Jehia or Zen's cause. There we go. So that pretty much wraps up day five. So am I can I see? Hello? Where Hello? Where where should I all through day six, I believe? Is that it? Let me see. Maybe it's the branching point. Is there yeah, there's a branching point here. So okay. So I'm pretty sure we gotta do a little bit more work up here. So let's get to it. Let's get right onto it. Or actually, yeah, let's get right onto it. Okay, let's continue on to the next day then. Let's go. You sung intuition. Okay, so he's. What was this conversation about? Um, I'm not too sure, but anyways. Let's say I'm worried about Jehi's. No, we're gonna say you're still up. We can't. We can't talk about Jehi here, okay? No matter what. So yes, I'm always up. I come here. Time. Yes, playing. Jimin talking about the cherry farms. Gonna sleep on ahead a little bit. Oh, but Jehi hates it. I know. Yes, I know. Uh, I think the cat will be safer. I know. If she picks up, I think the cat will be safer if he picks her up before Seven wants her more. Oh, I know. Just say I. I know. If he picks her up before Seven wants her. Yeah, we gotta be concerned about the cat. Yes. <laughs> I totally agree. And Jimin shouldn't be so stuck up. Yes. Okay, let's skip on ahead a little bit. Nope. So, okay. He's got a lot to say. We got a lot to say back. Okay, so you're right. I think even a small gesture would really cheer her up. Nothing we can do since he's the boss. Yeah, nothing we can do. He's the boss. Wait, what? I guess so. Hope Jehi cheers up. Oh, I talked with a friend while gaming. And yes, tuition... Okay, this is where we can skip because I remember we invited that whole tuition committee where they wanted to like, you know, for the students thing. Okay, we're gonna skip all of that. Okay, there we go. So we are done with Yu Sung's little conversation. Like I said, you guys, it's like with the whole tuition thing. We didn't invite them because we're not here for that purpose. But anyways, we are going to go ahead and continue on our next conversation, which is Zen's injury. Yes, we need to talk- was it because he sprang his ankle? Yes, I think so. Yeah, this is where it's leading up to the point where it's like... Jaehee wants to visit Zen and we're supposed to- the right the right things to do is to encourage her to do what her heart wants kind of thing. But for now, we of course are going to- <laughs> we're gonna be all up in Zen's business. So, Zen, you're still up? Yes. Are you here? Are you okay, boo? I have a problem. Yes, you broke your ankle. No, <laughs> kind of. Yes, I just... Uh, what? What happened? You're about to get a heart attack after seeing me? You're about to get a heart attack after seeing me? <laughs> I appreciate the joke, but it's because I'm hurt. Yes. I hurt my ankle. I'm sorry. I was trying to... I was trying to lighten the mood here. <laughs> it's because you practice so hard. Then stop chatting and, and call an ambulance right now. Yeah. Stop chatting. Call an ambulance right now. Yeah, I should. The pain's so bad, I feel like I'm about to die. Oh no. But... Yes, I thought that I should let everyone know before I come. Yes, you're such a you're, you're such a thoughtful guy. It hurts so bad. Oh no! Do you need anything else? Should I go? Jehi is going to worry so much. Be careful. I'll tell the other members. Don't worry. Should I go? Do you want me to come with you? <laughs> Thanks, but I'm used to taking care of things by myself, so I'll just go alone. I shouldn't have practiced so hard. Yes. Oh no. All right. Yeah. So. Alright, don't worry about us and take care of yourself. You have to get better soon. You have to get better soon, okay? I have a killer recovery rate. Okay, cool. Yes, even the other members try to reach me, I'll be sleeping I'll be sleeping to get better, yes. So don't worry. Okay. Yes, he'll get going. There we go. So we got a little bit more points with yeah, Zen, which was what we're supposed to do. We're supposed to lean more towards being romantic with Zen rather than supporting Jehi. So let's continue on. Oh my god, my hourglass. Don't worry, I'll probably get more just so I could just finish this bad ending so he has an injury yes he does everyone's 
finding out about it. Okay, so Jehi, did you read that Zeng got hurt? What did you do now that our handsome Zen's hurt? Yes, what do we do now? I feel as if Hani owns Zen now. It was only a metaphor, a problem with his bones. How hard do you think he that he worked himself? Zen's not here to answer. He might as well he might be in line waiting at the hospital. He might be in line at the hospital waiting. I'll have to see which hospital he went to. So if you're if you are that worried, I think you'll be yeah, I think it'll be good to contact him. Zen will take care of everything himself. Right, I guess. But we need to discourage her. It might be difficult considering that he is in pain. God, uh, am I being too nosy? You're not being too you're not being nosy. I won't stop you if you're worried, but he said he'd be back in the afternoon, yes. So last time he broke his arm was like one day. So he knew my Zen would be strong. Yes, <laughs> my Zen. <laughs> no, no. I know very well that Zen recovers enormously well. Yeah, but that does not mean we should relax. Oh. I know, I'm so possessive over Zen. They're just like, what the fuck is this girl on? <laughs> he gets hurt a lot because of what he does, but it must have been, it must have really hurt. It must have hurt, my love Zen. Jaehee, he'll be alright, calm down first. My love! <laughs> it must have hurt my love Zen. I should find out what, right now which hospital he went to. Him, I won't stop you, but he told us not to worry, yes. And then, yes. Zen's the type, type to take care of himself, you should respect his way. But it's natural for Jaehee to, wor Jae to worry, you should respect lovely Zen's way. Seconded, how about, what, how about you do what your heart tells you to do? Yes, we should know. We should be obviously more towards just respecting Zen. Yeah, la la la, lovely. Yeah, but it might just be that Zen doesn't know how to ask for help since he lived alone for so long. Yes, we already know that. Yes, and just pretend to be okay on the outside when he's not. And it's like, oh my god. You are changing your words. What do you want me to do? Lolo, you call me. <laughs> Is that what you thought I would say? Oh my gosh. Then I must visit his hospital room right away. <laughs> Oh, you caught me. Okay, this is just seven just playing mind games. Lol, lol, I would have went. Don't tease Jaehee, she's sincerely worried about her. I would have went. Just saying. That is making me more confused. Uh, but Jaehee, aren't you going to go to work? I will. I only logged in because I was worried. I should go to work now. Yes. Uh, don't worry too much right now. Get to work safe. Goodbye. Uh, yeah, goodbye. We shouldn't be too affectionate. <laughs> just say, just be neutral. I'm a bit embarrassed about making it such a fuss. Yes, goodbye. So, um, so what I meant is, don't listen to anyone and follow your heart. But I totally got her. Just tisk. <laughs> uh, Jaehee is Zen's fan, so she must be wor more worried. I don't really like Jaehee doing what everyone says. Jaehee is Zen's fan, so she must be more worried. I don't really like Jaehee doing what everyone says. What? I mean, it, sh it could be in like the, the good positive light where it's like, hey, Jaehee should be making her own decisions and not, you know, letting others boss her around. But we're not supposed to do that. We're supposed to... But it could also mean like, oh, I don't like it that you're suggesting that she should go and she shouldn't. <laughs> I don't know, because Jaehee is Zen's fan, so she must be more worried. I don't like... I don't know. I can't. Uh, that one's a little bit weird. So I only meant to tease her. Ugh, I had to leave. Just got called. Hanny, don't worry about Zen too much and have a good day. Okay. Goodbye, you 7 Yeah, goodbye. I, that was really confusing. I didn't know which one to really pick. But anyways, regardless, there we go. So Seven is trying to help in helping Jaehee decide whether or not to visit Zen. But we're here trying to prevent it, so like, stop that. <laughs> we're here to intervene. Anyways, here we go, my last five hourglasses. Oh boy. Ah. Okay, whatever. So about Zen's recovery speed, okay. You'll see, you'll see, just take lightly on this situation now. We're not gonna, we're not gonna spend time answering text messages. I feel like conversations matter more. So we're just gonna go ahead and uh, yeah. Talk to you, Song. That was really weird. I'm so sorry. Why is my game suddenly so laggy? Get it together, game, please. <laughs> please. Okay, so you, Song, aren't you going to school? Did you, did you hear Zen got hurt? Did you hear Zen got hurt? We need to ask after Zen, obviously. <laughs> yeah, so he, like, you, Song's like, oh no, what do we do? But, like, Zen obviously recovers very fast. And uh, I don't know why. Why is this happening? Why, y'all? Uh, why are you being so slow like this, game? Game, don't do this. You were doing so well. Okay, nah, he is that even for real? Uh, nah, I still, even still, nah, even still. Um, is that for real? Uh, nah, even is that for real? I guess, I guess. I have no idea in terms of this conversation. I'm probably gonna skip out most of it. 
Okay, so I think this is really different. I don't think we really had this happening to us, where it's like Yu Sung suggesting, even though after discussing how Zen's really fast at recovering and stuff, but he still says that I think it's a good idea for someone to visit him at the hospital. And our only option here when we go to answer is just why is that? So maybe it's some new shit. I don't know. Anyways, I'm t I'm totally sorry about what's happening with my game right now. Oh, there we go. So before Zen worked all kinds of small theater companies, Rigo told me that he was really poor and struggled alone, and you and to make something out for himself. Uh, that was. That way he was so used to doing things by himself without anyone's help, that's what she said. But now that he's not alone, just having someone nice taking care of him when he's not well would really help him. Why don't Jaehee or you, Hanny, uh, go visit Zen at the hospital? Yes, yeah, since V really said that we shouldn't meet Hanny. Since V never really said we should meet Hanny, I, if you know where he is, you can go visit him. Okay, so this, uh, okay, that's a look familiar. And I think my game has just heard me and it's kind of speeding up right now. So I think it'd be better for Jaehee to go. I'd like to go there myself since Zen is mine. Yes, we need to say that. Oh my god, are you serious? <laughs> um, I guess it won't be too bad to get to meet him because of this. Anyways, just having someone nice taking care of him when he's not well would really help him. I'm sure Zen would hate it if I visit him since I'm a guy, yes. I guess I'll go lol lol. It's, I think it'd be nice to Jaehee go since she's more attractive. I guess I'll go. <laughs> I'll go. That doesn't sound too bad. I'll go get ready for school now. Don't worry too much about Zen. Okay. Okay, goodbye. There we go. So we, we like... Everything's speeding up a little bit now. There's no more delay. Thank God. Thank you, game. Thank you for behaving, being nice to me. Anyways, that just pretty much takes out last of my hourglasses. I'm gonna do what I can with my hearts. And then, of course, I will... Uh, let's see how many conversations we have left in the sixth day before supposedly we're supposed to get our bad ending. Oh my God, I feel like that's a lot. So, 5, 10, 15, 20... 20, 20, okay. I don't know if I can get 20, but well, whatever, I'll, I'll do it. Okay guys, so yes, I only managed to get a measly 7 hourglass out of my hearts that I had collected. So sad face, whatever. Anyways, regardless, we're gonna keep on going, we're gonna keep chugging along. We are in it, we are in it, we're committed, we're committed to this. So new project of course with Jaehee and Jumin here. We are going to have to... We're going to have to do some bit of damage here. So did you two have lunch? I'm a bit worried about my love Zen. I'm a bit worried about my love Zen. Hanny, you're here. <laughs> She's always so like nervous and like unsure whenever we come up. You use the word loved very curiously. She must be very worried that Zen got injured. Let's just... Let's say that's the case. Anyways, getting injured because of practicing too hard. How unprofessional. So I was thinking... That yes, that you should... Jaehee was like, I'm gonna go visit. And he's like, isn't your work more important? I think he'll really like it if you go, Jaehee. Isn't your work more important? I was just about to say, we're gonna sign with Jumin here. <laughs> I would like to be generous and let you and let you go, but something's come up. What is it? You know that our company is preparing to launch a coffee franchise. Yes, this is where Jumin assigns to her the new coffee project that he wanted to do. Or more like his father wants to do because his girlfriend at the time wants to open up her own cafe shop. So she's basically dumping it all on Jaehee and yeah. And he's just, and at one point he's asking her, like, okay, if you really don't want to do this because you're swamped with other projects, why don't you just half-ass it and just be like, oh, the project's not going to be good, so we could just, you know, basically just, you know, push it aside then. And then, of course, Jaehee, being the perfectionist, was perfectionist, was like, no, it's not against company policy, like, I don't, I feel bad if I do that, like, we shouldn't do that. And Jim was just like, why not, kind of thing. Okay, there we go, so... It sounds fun, good luck, Jaehee, don't you have enough work already? Yeah, it sounds fun, good luck. Good luck, Jaehee. <laughs> I'm sure Assistant Ken can pull it off. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so bad. First, have them create a research report and share it, and make sure they get educated first. Yes, and he's like, do this, this, and this, and this, and this, because I know you can do it, Assistant Kang. Yes. <laughs> So it's not about the reward, doesn't Jaehee have the right to get some rest while working? I'm so jealous, haha, <laughs> pay raise, pay raise, lol. Oh, she's not amused. <laughs> she is not amused. Aside from the rewards, I do not know if I can handle all of it. With this schedule, I am not confident I can finish everything properly. I am still uh, contacting the winery regarding the contract, and I have to prepare for the meeting with the golf clothing company and deal with the personal projects that your, such as your magazine photo shoot. And there are so many other projects that are currently in progress. You are aware, aren't you? And he's just like, Assistant Kang, yes, but this project just slack off. Yeah, he's just like, whatever, it's just whatever. It's just my dad's the one who's requested it because of his girlfriend. There we go, so yeah. So Jimin, isn't that against company's policy to work like that? Yeah, good idea. Good idea! 
Yeah, do it. Do you think so, Hanny? Yeah, sure. Why not? I personally think a bit differently. Yeah, because she's a perfectionist. We don't need personal opinions right now. So if you work, you get- if you work, you get happy, so cheer up. Uh, but still. If you work, you get happy, so cheer up. That is true. <laughs> that may be so, but alright for now. Alright, and regarding the coffee, I think it was the Roasty Association. No, we're not gonna invite them. We don't got time. I we don't got time for this, okay? We are not here for that today. Anyways, yes, it'll be difficult because I want to visit Zen and it's like, well, why don't you have Hanny go visit? So I think it'll be better if she could- no, sh should I go? Haha, <laughs> yes, I should go. Yes, I think that's not a bad idea. Yes, I'm going. He'll be discharged soon, why don't we wait for a bit longer? Well, I guess he'll be completely fine in a couple of hours, then I must go and take care of some things. Goodbye. I think I will have a lot of work. Will Zen be okay? Don't worry about it, girl. I'll, I'll take care of him. Don't worry too much, he'll be fine. Jehi, I think you should focus on your work right now. I think you should focus on your work right now. Yes, I will try to. I will get going as well. Have a good day. Yes. Haha. <laughs> okay, we need to push her away. We can't encourage her. We need Zen uh, to ourselves, <laughs> essentially. We need to be super yandere about this. Okay, so I think I'm going to skip out on this story mode. Of course, it's nothing. Nothing's going to change, I think. Yep, there we go. So essentially, that whole story mode was, uh, what's it called? Seven finding out that they've been hacked, and that's it. So someone must be chasing us. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, we should we should obviously get into chat, get to chat in here with Seven about that matter. So let's uh, let's continue. I'll probably skip out on a lot of this conversation as well because I feel like it might not, again, pertain to what we're doing here. So okay, I'm thinking I'm thinking about visiting my love Zen at the hospital. Yes, we're gonna of course announce that instead of greeting Seven. <laughs> hey, uh, honey. Uh, hey, honey. Nope. <laughs> nope. What? I can already hear his footsteps coming back home. Just wait a bit more. But um, I stopped by my house while well, I stopped by my house while during work. God, I have some news to tell everyone, but it's not good. Yes, I should give the good news first. Yes, yes, yes. Scott stalking. You don't think our Zen? So of course, Seven has broken the news to us that we've been stalked. We're getting stalked. I think it's not so much. It's hacked and then stalked. I think so. He's like, I think because we got hacked, we might be stalked as well. So of course, we have the option of being concerned over Jehi or being concerned over Zen. So we're gonna be concerned over Zen, obviously. So why don't you worry about yourself first? <laughs> I went to security tapes outside the apartment just in case and I found someone that looked like a stalker, yes. Oh my god, that's so funny. I think like they're so done with our antics with like, Where's Zen? Where's my love Zen? So why the hell is he targeting me? I'm scared. Um, Why the hell would they target me? I guess? We should say that, I guess. I'm trying to figure that out, but I may be overreacting a bit. First, I'm watching this action to see if he's really a stalker. Is it possible? Don't leave your apartment handy. Okay, there we go. Yes, yeah, security guards to our place. Is he trying to kidnap me? Not just me, everyone should be careful, this is scary. Is he trying to kidnap me? Uh, well, we're not so con so much concerned about like being distrustful towards RFA, because I think that's not necessarily our main goal here into getting our bad story end right now, so nah, we can just, we can just kind of flake out on this answer just a bit. Okay, so we of course mentioned the fact that Zen is the only one who's outside of his apartment right now, or his home, because of course Seven was like, I think everyone should just stay where they are, like in their house, then that's safer that way, but it's, yeah, aside from Zen. So then he's like, yes, I can't reach him now, and like, it's, it's ner making me nervous, so like, isn't our Zen getting kidnapped or something? We need to be concerned, hmm, the boy can't let that happen, I think it's top priority to figure out who's behind this all. Yes, you gotta be more careful. Okay, please find out who's responsible. Then I'll get to work. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. So there's that. There we go. We got a little bit more on talks of Zen. <laughs> and I, ac I actually accepted uh, trying to get, what's it called? The hacker person that I messed up on the first time around where it's like, he's like, I need to find out information about Seven. Please let me know who he is. And we accidentally revealed that to him. And he's like, haha, I know who his real name is. And yeah, yeah, and I lost that person. So I might try just as a side little thing, side objective for me. Just because I want my hourglasses. I need, I need my hourglasses, yo. <laughs> okay, so let's continue on with this. Of course, we're going to worry about that later. So I got discharged, yes. Zen got discharged. Zen? Oh, our handsome Zen, you didn't see a stock on your way back, right? It's, yes, our handsome Zen. Hey, honey. <laughs> He's just like, what are you even talking about? Hello, of course not. Yes, that's a relief. You read what Seven said, huh? Nope, Yo. he didn't because he's too busy at the hospital getting his cast. Yeah. 
not as bad as I thought, yes. But they told me that, to, that not to move as much as possible. I think at least Jay he should go see you. Should I go see you? But first, the hacker threat is more important. Should I go see you? Oh my god. Nah, no need. It's embarrassing. <laughs> Did you see read what 7 said above? Yeah. Go read it. Read it, Zen. Yeah. There, there he goes. There he goes. Oh my god, yes. He's so fast. Uh -huh. I read all of it. Yes. Stalker. Honey, are you scared? Holy shit, I'm more worried about Zen I am, but I trust V and several stuff to protect me. I'm more worried that my husband Zen might have a stalker. I'm so scared that I don't think I can sleep. I'm more worried that my husband <laughs> jumping the gun so fast. I'm already like like in a in an opposite way of wifed him. I've husbanded him <laughs> without his consent. I'm gonna be cre me? <laughs> yes. Ah uh, yeah, since you can't even move very well, but Honey, guess you have Guess you have feelings for Zen, haha. <laughs> hmm. Do I have another fan now? Lol lol. I'm more than just a fan. Uh, yeah! <laughs> I'm more a girlfriend than a fan. <laughs> OMG. Um. <laughs> I don't feel too bad that. Too bad to hear that. Oh my god. Anyways, of course Hanny has to be careful. Yes. I <laughs> That's so funny. That's just like. Oh, uh, okay. Whatever you say, girl. But I'll get better seeing whatever happens, happens. Okay. Except I might be overreacting, it's not necessary to make such a big fuss over it. What do you mean whatever happens, happens? Don't be so relaxed. Yeah, don't be so relaxed, I guess. Um, but I'm fine, really. Yeah, as Hanny said, you can't let your guard down. But I, I'm a bit creeped out. I think it's overreacting to think someone's after us. Yes. Okay, so you Sung, of course, is just saying and reiterating the fact that we should, we should be really careful and that we need to stay indoors for the time being because of this hacker stalker dude. And uh, yeah, and he's just offered, uh, he just made an offer to Zen on, on helping him out because of his limited mobility but Zen's just like dude forget it that's gross and then he's just like I'll take care of myself don't worry and yeah so we're gonna, we're gonna make a comment here just make sure you rest Zen why don't you stop trying to take care of things by yourself and ask Jay he or someone else to help I, I think at least I should go what if something happens to my love Zen what happens what would happen to you my love <laughs> I'm really fine uh, if I cut my finger while cutting carrots, you come help help me then. Gah, scary. <laughs> la la la. I'm more worried about Hanny. Chases of hacker and the stalker too. I hope we find out who's behind this. Hope it's nothing. Yeah. There you go. And everyone just kind of keep talking about that all. Bye, lovely Zen. Okay. <laughs> He's still to you. Do you think Zen will really be okay? Okay, so we just recently... You saw on his closing remarks recently just mentioned how Jaehee or Jumin has made Jaehee more work to do and of course Zen's just like he's a jerk and we're just like but getting more work is good right and he they're just like I guess and so they're leaving now so we're gonna they're gonna I, we said bye lovely Zen he's just you know indulging us and I can't help but worry I think he'll be fine if he gets better fast I can't help but worry do you think Zen will be okay I can't help but worry oh my god me too yes I am a bit worried yes I should go play games yes Alrighty then. Okay, bye bye. There we go. Conclusion. It was fun talking to you. Yes, me too. Okay. So there's that. And we have another story mode, I believe. But I think I'm going to skip out on that because I think it's nothing too. Uh, what's it called? I don't think nothing's changed. Okay, figured it out. So it's basically the first story mode with Seven beforehand, it was when Seven found out about the hacker thing and then he went, he just made the comment that he should contact V and then this next one is just basically Juman who V contacted and he's just like, this is surprising because wow, V never just like messages out of the blue, like he's so elusive. Anyways, let's continue on with Juman's conversation here. And uh, yeah, do some more damage. Jumin, is Jaehee very busy? It'd be nice if she could visit Zen. Did you hear about the hacker? No, we can't, we, do, we don't need to encourage, we can't encourage this. Okay, so did you hear about the hacker? Did ya, yeah? Yes, I just heard. Yes, cool. So I, and I read it, and I was a bit surprised. Yes, I know. The information 707 gave this time is too fragmentary. Uh, I hope it's nothing. Uh, Assistant Kang and I always have security guards around our safe around around so our safety is secured. I just got a call from V. Yeah, and he asked me to send security guards. Yes. Uh huh. So will I be okay? Can I trust V? Are we are we in that much danger to need security guards? So I can't. And the the guide said to never really go forward or lean more towards like being untrusting, distrusting. Sorry, distrusting towards the RFA people and the members and V just yet so I don't know I'm so we're still trying to just basically assert our affections and love interest to Zen and like rejecting Jaehee's friendship essentially that's the main 
goal, the main objective to get this bad story end. So I feel like, again, we can skirt around this and we can just be like, whatever, for the answers. I'm worried about Zen. Of course I'm worried about him. That does bother me a little bit as well. If it was me coming after RFA, I might kidnap Zen and try to get information. <laughs> nice. Since his fan mail address and his house address are the same. Oh yes, that's kind of stupid of him. Why don't you get a P.O. box? Jesus. Yes, of course, yes. Um, I think it will I think I will be safe as long as I stay inside the apartment. Will it be enough to just place security guards around Zen's house? Yeah, we need to be worried about Zen, no? Yeah, uh, Zen's problem is bothering me. Uh-huh. Yeah, I d it it have been better if he didn't get injured, right? So why don't you ask Jehi to go be with Zen? No, well, should I go to Zen? I want to. I want to. We should first think about it. <laughs> He's just like, no. Uh, since it would be dangerous to be leave the apartment as well. Okay, so there's nothing bad about being careful, so be careful and more careful. Contact, contact Assistant Kang and have her send security guards. I feel bad that I'm logging out so soon. Okay. Uh, it's okay, we can talk later. Please tell Jehi I'm okay. No. We need to reject her friendship. It's okay, we can talk later. Yes, we will. Okay, so... Hmm, I wonder what this bad ending might entail now that I haven't really said much about predictions on what this bad story ending might be. Maybe it's because we might... we might... We might end up getting hurt, perhaps? Maybe because we're so adamant on like going to visit Zen and then because we left the apartment during this whole time of like being stalked and shit like that, that we're gonna get kidnapped ourselves? <gasps> Maybe on our way to Zen's place? Maybe. I don't know. Whatever. Let's go. We're like hopefully one, two conversations away from actually finding out. So Hanny, what? <laughs> Seven, what are you doing? So Jehi, Zen's back from the hospital. I'm worried he might be in danger. Seven, what are you doing here and not catching the hacker? Should we ignore Jehi? I think we should. <laughs> Ouch. Oh, I'm gonna go work soon. Jehi. <laughs> yeah, you must have been pretty busy to really log in today. Yeah. Hit with a storm of work. So did you find any information on the hacker? Ha ha ha. No, he, he hasn't. So answer seven. Ha 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 ha. Uh, answer seven. Yes, please answer the question. So about that, yes. Jehi, the project are the project you're working on right now. Is it searching about coffee shop franchises? You remembered, okay? So Mr. Han, uh, Mr. Han had to take on the another department's work about uh, because of cherry. Uh, Mr. Han had to take on another department's work because of the cherry farm incident. Yes, I think you should be the busiest one right now. Seven, cheer up, Jehi. No, we can't encourage her. <laughs> Sad face, crying emoji. Uh, I just came out of a cup of coffee. I'll go back to work soon. Don't be so harsh on me. <laughs> if you had to, if we have to change the subject, as Seven insists, I'm very glad to hear that Zen got back home safe. He recovers like a monster, so he might get the cast taken out tomorrow. Yes, he just recovers so well. The way that way, he'll be able to protect himself if anything happens. You know, so he can't protect himself right now. So at least I should go visit him. I'm still a bit nervous. Why don't you go visit him, Jay? No, we need to insist that we need to go. Hanny, you? Hmm, that doesn't sound like a bad idea at all. It's, but it's not as if Hanny is exactly exactly safe right now with the stalker and all. So that's true, but if the two people in danger are together, it'd be easier to protect them. Uh, is that so? But in the first place, if none of us, if none of this happened, we need to think about something. Blah, blah, blah. Yes, what's going on, Seven? What's happening with the hacker? What are you doing? How much of information have you found out? <laughs> yes. Uh, so you mean they didn't just hack us by accident? No, that's why it's scary. Yeah. Yes, they're after us, like for sure, for sure. So why would anyone do that? This organization doesn't have ties with the underworld. Why would anyone do that? We can't be a little too distrustful now, I guess. No, again, I'm trying to avoid that. The organization hasn't done anything to make enemies. On the contrary, I think we had did a lot of good, yes. Like, aren't you supposed to be a charity party? Yes. But just go visit him, Jay. You know, I'll go. I can guard Zen. I can go guard, lol. I don't think he'll refuse you to, if he, I don't think he'll refuse if you go Hanny. If there's anything, if there's any, if there isn't any problem with Hanny going, then I would be not against it. I think any of you could just go. Let's make this world everyone's, yes. Blah 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 blah. So I think Jay he was imagining something weird, I really think it'd be better for innocent me to take the risk and go. <laughs> Innocent me, what a hypocrite. So it's it's so what's so important about your social about social customs? Uh haha Jehi, you should go. You should just go. No. We need to insist that we we need to go. I do not imagine such things, but if you wish to go, I will send over more security guards. According to social customs rather than Hanny or me, can't you yeah, can't you or, or you send visit him and he's like nah. He's like we'll we'll be kicked out because 
Zen's weakness is women. Is that so? And it's it's not as if you'll be alone with Zen. There'll be a bunch of security guards around outside. Yes, I know. So it's like, it'll be packed outside. Should I? What about... Well, hey, no, I'll go. I can take better care of Zen. Yeah, I'll go. I need to go. Since he's never seen you before, he, it might throw him off, though. I think Hanny will be able to do a good job taking care of him. Oh, I just thought of a dangerous scenario. Reason one why Jaehee or Hanny must go to Zen. Zen will be unwell from the injury. Yes. He gets attacked by a lynx, and it's like, oh my god, the lynx is like a, his own, Seven's own metaphor of like, a kidnapper, and he gets a scar, and we're like, oh no, Jaehee, you should really go, no, a scar on my man's face, <laughs> yeah, so hurry and go, you have, you have just told a very nerve-wracking story. Uh, Zen face is on the line here, who cares about social custom? That is true, yeah, I'll get going. Lucia, I hope you stop playing around here and solve the hacker problem. Hey, so she's, end she's gonna end up going anyways? What? Even after all the time that we've been insisting? Oh my gosh, okay, so I, I wonder how this is gonna affect. Okay, so we can't encourage her. So yeah, Seven, just go back to work. Ah, right. If we had prevented the hacking in the first place, we wouldn't have had the, to think about this. Are you blaming everything on Mina? I am not. I am only saying that you should go back to work, and then, hurry, then I'll hurry, okay. Okay, so she's, she's still insistent. She's still going. Huh. Okay then, I hope I did it right. I did everything right. Like I don't want to have to do this all over again and wasted my hourglass for nothing. Girl, I was hev I was totally insistent. Okay, let's just... Um, do I have a slot? I swear I do. But let's just see. Let's just see. Would it really matter? I think, nah. Okay, never mind. You know what? Never mind. I'm not gonna save. Whatever. Like, if I mess up here, I mess up. I would have to do it over again anyways. It's because, yeah, yeah. As long as I have... Yeah. Okay, let's just go. Let's just let's just hope for the best. <laughs> let's just hope for the best, you guys. Okay, come on. So, okay, so very private visit. Never-ending work. Okay, there we go. Okay, so I feel like I got it. So this, is, this looks pretty new. Alright, okay, so let's story mode it. Okay, this is 7 story mode apparently, so this is probably new stuff, and this is new as well because this is actually inside our own apartment. I don't, I don't think we've, we've gotten this before, so let's go on, go on ahead and see what the hell's up. Okay. Oh, someone's banging our doorbell. I think it's the stalker. Hello? Opens the door. Who is it? Why can't I, why can't I save? Who is it? Is it is it either is it anyway? Either way, they're gonna just bust in here. Who is it? We, we should ask. Who's it? Who's it? Who is it? Soyo, Lucia. Okay, so we open the door, which is surprising. Okay, so it's actually Lucille, which is great. I thought it was someone hella shady, but no, he's here. What? Me. He actually is here. Oh my god. This is technically our first meeting. Oh my god. 제 얼굴을 실제로 보는 건 처음이죠? 반가워요. 천재의 커 707입니다. Yeah. Oh my god, our first meeting. What are you doing here? <laughs> what are you doing here? 어 가만히 앉아서 생각해 봤는데 님이 계속 말해 왔듯이 역시 님이랑 재념이랑 같이 있는 게 나을 것 같아요. Okay, so he's in agreement with us. 그쪽으로 경호를 집중시키면 주민이 형 일도 편해지고 주민이 형 일이 편해지면. 결국 제이 씨도 편해지는 거니까요. 오케이. Okay. 제이 씨가 가뜩이나 바빠 보이는데 병문안까지 가라고 하긴 좀 가혹하기도 하고요. 알라이이 몸이 직접 님을 제니 형 집으로 데려다 주려고 왔으니 oh. 같이 출발해요. 오케이. Okay. 자, 어서 출발해요. 밴더우드가 망을 봐주고 있는 사이에 가야 할까? 밴더우드 who that? Where are Vanderwood? Who the fuck? Who the fuck? 아, 아무것도 아니에요. 이리 오세요. Oh, I don't trust it. <laughs> What? Okay. Um, okay, are you actually Lucio? What? Okay, we go in. Okay. Oh, I don't like this. <laughs> I think I think we're getting tricked. <laughs> okay. Okay, we're in the car. Oh my god, I don't like this. 그럼 출발할게요. Okay. Something tells me we've we been tricked. I don't know. Can it? Because I have no idea. Whatever. Whatever. We going.
we we going apparently. Okay, there we go. Very private visit. Oh, it's like it's like he actually takes us. Like, sorry, it's just me and my shady ass just like sketched out about everything. Like, I'm so distrusting. <laughs> Anyways, there we go. So we're gonna join in on this conversation with Seven here. So it's a very private visit. So it's actually Seven who's gonna take us to go visit Zen. Alrighty, okay. Alrighty, righty, righty. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, so what do you mean? What are you what are you doing? Yeah, what are you doing? Aren't you aren't you aren't we like in the same car right now? <laughs> or aren't we sitting beside each other? <laughs> what's Zen's doing? What's Zen doing? You know what's happening right now. Zen's not opening the door. Oh, oh, okay. I hope he sees this and opens the door for us. Maybe he's sleeping. Why isn't he answering his calls? <gasps> oh Jay, what? Is something going on? Uh yeah, so Hanny and I are at Zen's house. Oh, with Hanny, yes. With me. I came to take care of him for you, Jay Heath. Yes, to take care of him. Yes, to take care of him. We gotta still keep up our bitch act. <laughs> uh, oh, you're really here. Are you really there? That's good. Okay. Uh, yeah, but Zen's not opening the door. Did you try calling him? Yes, his phone's off. Oh no, oh no, what? I think the undercover security guards know we're here. Okay. Uh, but I feel like they'll start talking us if we do something weird. Hanny is there, so be careful, huh? I just heard something inside. Hanny, hurry and come here. What? I hope everything goes well. Okay. No, no, no. What am I doing? Cancel. I meant to say answer. So yep, just leave it to me and get back to work. Don't come. Don't tell me you want to be the one to come now. Uh. We should just be like, yep, just leave it to me. Get back to work. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, let's just give this one to her for for just this once. This is one. We're on our way to the bad ending anyways. I feel so. We, there's no. There's no. Like redeeming us. So don't tell me you wanted to be the one to come now. No, it's nothing like that. Okay. Uh, I'm just worried that it's a bit late. Okay. Oh, she still worries about us. Even after. Oh, Seven's calling for me. I have to go. Yeah. Bye. All right. Please update me soon. Okay. Oh, she's so nice. Even after all the time, we're just like, no, Jehi. Like I'm the one who should be visiting Zen. I'm the one who's in love with him, not you. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. There we go. So there we go. Story mode. Here we go. What's happened? Why isn't Zen answering his phone? Is he not home? Where did he go? Where'd he go? Zen? What? Oh. Oh, maybe it's because he's asleep. <laughs> maybe. Yes, hello. Uri Chode Damdang Jarago. Hindelge de Ruande. Olen Insa Shio. Yeah, hello. No. Also, when did you? Yongmura Rachi. Yeah. 병문은? 이 밤중에? Yes, I know it's a little sketchy, but it's the only way. 어, 이 님도 위험한 상황이니까 둘이 한대 몰아넣고 경호하라는 부영의 명령이야. Now I don't know about that. <웃음> 아, 그건 병문안이 아니잖아. 아. 아무튼 잘 부탁해. 나는 바로 일하러 가봐야 해서 간다. Did we actually say that? Like, why did we get that? Huh? Whatever. 어, 그래. Okay, whatever, yeah. Yeah, okay, so then we should just go with her. Yeah, we should just be just like, yeah, we should just go with her. Yeah, we should just be uh-huh. Why did the music stop? <laughs> Why did the carefree music stop? 혹시 나 이성으로 생각하고 있는 거 아니야? I guess. I mean, that's the whole point. What? <laughs> really? I not I can't even I don't even got an option to answer back. What? I mean, by logic, yes. By what I'm supposed to be doing, yes. So, whatever, okay. Let's continue on. This is the last of the conversation before we get our bad ending and see where the hell is supposed to conclude in terms of Zen's question. Holy shit. Okay, so never ending work with Jumin. What's up, my dude? What's happening, Hanny? What? Did you get there safe? Yes, I guess you did. It was quite sudden. I know. <laughs> Even I got sketched out. I'm doing fine with Zen. I'm doing fine with Zen. Yes, my man. <laughs> I'm glad to hear that. Okay, so I thought Assistant Kang would go there. I know, right? But I said I insisted. You're talking about going to Zen's house. Hani, is everything okay? Yes, I, everything's fine. Yes, everything's fine. 
Everything's perfect. That's good. Okay. Uh huh. That's good. Uh, I'm glad that you went there instead of me, as I have a lot of as I have a ton of work to do. Assistant Kang. Yes. Okay. Um. What's, what's how this gonna end, guys? I'm I'm like thrown off. I shouldn't have I shouldn't have been caught going to the farm. I think he plant. I shouldn't have been caught going to the farm. I think he plans to hand over another project along with the coffee one. Oh. That doesn't sound good. Yes, that doesn't sound so good. And she's just over it. Mr. Han, did you, yeah, you refused, right? Now I was going to, but well, what? Did he blackmail you again? Again? <laughs> what? Uh, it's a fashion convention for clothing companies, and the artist and tailor who makes cat clothes will be there. Oh my god, Mr. Han, please have mercy. Oh no. <laughs> Anything cat related, he's on it. Ah, uh, poor Jaehee. He's the one who designed the bead costume uh, that put every pet owner in a frenzy. Apparently, it's time he's this time he's doing a fashion show centered on Frozen. <gasps> Mr. Han, it, I just couldn't refuse. I'd like to host that event and make sure that that tailor gets the spotlight. Oh my God, Elsa Elizabeth the Sec the Third. Oh my God, that sounds so cute. Haha. <laughs> oh no, Jaehee, what are you going to do? That actually sounds low key cute though. Not gonna lie, I thought so too. <laughs> Sorry, Jaehee. Anyways, Assistant Kang. I need you. We'll talk about the details tomorrow. Oh my gosh, this is depressing. It is. I'm so sorry, girl. All for science. Don't be too depressed. I have good news for you. What is it? Wait, well, what? Are you giving me a vacation? No. <laughs> no, of course not. Of course not, silly. Uh, what is he giving you? What's he doing? What's the good news? More work? Maybe? Uh, the, conven the convenience store is 300 months meters away from the office building. Wasn't it uncomfortable going there every day to buy sandwiches? I'm planning to put a convenience store on the first floor for you. Are you serious? Yes, Como. you can be grateful. <laughs> wow. Her own personal cafeteria. Jumin, that's so cool. Is that really good news? Haha. <laughs> that's so cool, Jumin. You're so cool. You <laughs> well, I don't know about that. <laughs> oh my god. No, actually, it is pretty cool. Oh my god. OMG, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, J.E. I'm just putting you through so much. Change, the rent is extremely expensive for a convenience store, but I made a deal with my father to cooperate to operate the store myself. Thank you. I won't have to go out now. <laughs> yes, you will have at least ten minutes more to spare. I consider this a better deal than a couple of days off. Yes, you are right. The next quota is approaching, so we'll have to work hard. Ah, uh, she's completely given up. <laughs> then I have to go switch Elizabeth the Third's water bowl. Uh, have a good night, both of you. A convenience on. store on the first floor. Haha, <laughs> convenience store. I'll have to work very hard. Oh no, she's lost her mind. Jehee, is this a bit sad? Good luck, it'll be easier to work now. Yeah. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> oh no. She's like losing it. Oh no, hey, Yusung. Oh, oh my god, Jehee. Uh, what? Be careful you don't end up like Jehee. Yusung, aren't you jealous of Jehee? Be careful you don't end up like Jehee. Lol, lol, lol. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying, I'm scared of getting a job now. <laughs> lol. I, I want to live in the world of lol lol. Bye everyone. <laughs> she just, she just, yeet. Bye. Okay, but anyways, back onto the thing with Zen. What's with the whole conversation, that cliffhanger? Like, what's happening? How is this the bad story end? Tell me. How, tell me. What's gonna happen? What's gonna happen to us? What? What's happening? Three years later. Wow, we're doing a time skip? What? This is so okay. Jaehee, 정말 축하드려요. 이번에 월급 또 올랐다죠? Oh, so she's finally got her pay raise. Okay. 네. <laughs> but she's she's hella sick though. She sacrificed her health for that. Oh no. 누나, 괜찮아요? I guess that's the bad story. Yet, is that we we pushed her so so much and not have like have our friendship offered to her that she just got sick. Or she's become an alcoholic. I don't know. Yeah, man, Jaehee, Jesus. Is it the whole, like, oh, pay raise, gotta have that company dinner? I'm going to have to do a lot of 요즘 제이 씨볼 때마다 얼굴이 점점 흑빛이 되어가는 것 같아서 마음이 좀 안쓰러워요. 야. Yeah. 이렇게 매번 축하하는 것도 좋지만 제이 씨 건강이랑 돈이랑 맞바꾸는 느낌이 든다니까요. Oh, such is the life. 빨리 연애도 하시고 시집도 가셔야 될 텐데. She's like, no, I must continue on my career. 
재령 이야기가 왜 갑자기 그리로 빠져요 염장 지르는 것도 아니고 참 Oh my god, are we married to Zen? 야, 넌 질투가 나면 그렇다고 솔직히 말해, 어? <웃음> I think so! Oh my god! We, get, we got together with Zen, holy shit! 누가 알았겠어요? 그때 그 병문 안으로 형이랑 신입분이랑 이어질 줄을요 Oh, wow! We move fast, Jesus! 세븐이 녀석의 발 빠른 대처가 가장 컸지 I mean... <웃음> 그때부터 3년째 동거라니 나는 언제 그 근처에라도 가볼까요? 넌 아직 멀었어. 일단 취직이나 하셔. 아, 맞다. 제가 몇 군데 추천해 드리죠. 오케이. 자기, 왜 표정이 별로 안 좋아? I don't know. 제이씨 보더니 마음이 아픈가 봐. Oh. <웃음> I'm so petty. What? Even after three years, girl, you got your man and you're still like, ugh, Jehi. Like, she nearly stole my man right under my nose. 하여간 마음은 정말 착해 빠졌다니까. Oh my god. 저는 걱정하지 않으셔도 됩니다. 원래 이렇게 사는 인생이니까요. No, okay, no, 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 never mind. I was gonna say, I was like, I thought I was giving her a dirty look, but no, we're just like, we look, we, we gave a look pity towards Jehi. 담당자님이라도 행복하셨으면 좋겠어. Yeah. 제가 꿈에서나 그리던 사람을 바로 곁에 두셨으니 정말 부럽게 그지 없습니다. Oh no. 제이 씨가 또나 칭찬해 주시네. Okay. 요즘 네 덕분에 정말 일할 맛도 난다니까. I mean, I'm glad to hear. <웃음> 음, 뭐두 분이 잘 돼서 정말 다행이에요. 그런데 제이 누나 월급 오는 거 축하하는 자리에서 너무 닭살인 것 같은데요. Indeed, that's the least I can give her. <웃음> 우린 뭐 원래 닭살이잖아. 뭐 이렇게 다른 사람들 있는 데서 보면 왜더 떨리고 좋지? <웃음> And oh my God, Zen is such a sweetie still. He's so whipped for us. That's the same way I'm whipped for him. Holy shit! Can Zen not do anything wrong? Like, oh my God. 자리를 비켜야겠군요. I know. I know. 누나 왜 그래요? Yeah, don't be like that. 아니요. 정말 피곤해서 그렇습니다. 저는 먼저 들어가 보겠습니다. 오케이. Okay. 어? 아, 저 혼자 여기 있으라고요? <웃음> yes. 아직 처리해야 할 일도 있어서요. 그럼 먼저 가 보겠습니다. I think she's gonna have a breakdown. She sounds like she's gonna have a breakdown. 담당자님. Yes. 조금 더 많이 이야기하고 싶었습니다. Oh no. 행복하십시오. Oh, she's like. Ah, ah, no! That's what happened. Jay, he's just like, yeah, bad ending. Okay, there we go. Yeah, Jay, he's just basically we've we've taken over the route of the, her being happy kind of thing, where it's like we've we put our own happiness above hers. That's the bad ending. Ah, no, that's so sad. <laughs> that's so sad. Anyways, there we go. So we got our bad ending, bad story, and number one completed. Yay! Which means we get to move on to bad story and two. I'm so sorry that these episodes are taking so long in between to like do because of the whole hourglass thing. Um, so I again, um, my plan mostly for this is like I would try to gather as many hearts as I can to convert to hourglasses. But either way, I feel like. Once I have like I guess a sufficient amount, I would obviously go on ahead and do whatever I can in terms of the conversation, and then afterwards, um, be um, be buying hourglasses to like you know I guess finish off the rest of the other endings. But I think I might not go in order. I don't know if that's the case because I know for the fact that some of the other bad endings, what requires me to do is that I have to participate. Less than thirty percent in conversations in order to get bad endings, so I might just end up doing that just because I know for a fact that it won't cost me hourglasses. I'll just go through conversations, and then I'll just reach up to the point where it's like, you know, I this is the bad ending, and it's like, yay, okay, this is what happens. So I might just do that just for my own econo being economical about hourglasses. But yeah, other than that, there we go, first bad ending, and uh, yeah. yeah. So I'll see you guys next time. And uh, for now, uh, bye!